Good morning, Mark Rapp, Operations on the Open Chain Fire for September 24th, 2020. So uh, for those of you that don't know, we got a little bit of rain last night, about uh, two tenths, according to the weather uh, meteorologist. And the folks on the ground that were out there last night said they got about a two hour period of pretty decent rain. So if you're seeing this and you uh, live around the fire area, that's kind of what uh, happened last night. So you probably know how much rain you got. So with that, uh, that of course makes a big difference, uh, at least in the uh, part of the fire that's open uh, to the skies, the stuff that's not open to the skies, it has can heavy canopy. Uh, that, that was probably not enough rain to uh, penetrate the canopy. So anything that's uh, protected as far as uh, tree cover or shrub cover it probably didn't get a lot of rain last night. So according to the meteorologist, uh, that two tenths equ equates to about a million gallons per acre. So some of you <coughs> can do the math. So as far as uh, today's operation, um, we have combined uh, Alpha Tango, which is basically this south part of the fire here down uh, towards uh, Lake Creek um, and then Brownsboro and then uh, Eagle Point here. So those divisions have been consolidated. We are, uh, with the change in weather, we are also reducing the number of resources we have on day shift and in preparation for a transition to a type, uh, smaller type three organization. Echo and Foxtrot up here on the, uh, up towards Shady Cove and up uh, Indian, um, Indian Creek up there. That's uh, also um, been combined. Uh, we'll have less resources also out there. Um, as far as the suppression resources, we're actually uh, increasing the number of repair resources, which is the heavy equipment and other, um, other stuff to kind of repair the, the, uh, all the work we did with the dozers, putting the suppression lines in. So Division Sierra will, st will stand alone. We'll have, uh, again, uh, probably minimal amount of resources out there, and uh, that's going to continue to collapse. Uh, as we move forward. Uh, division uniform here, um, still that's probably the, because of that, the vegetation type out there, heavy timber, um, a lot of material on the ground. Um, we'll continue to uh, see a lot of heat in there, especially the interior uh, part of the fire, but we're still getting a pretty good perimeter on it. And uh, so that's, that's kind of where we are. And uh, we'll continue on uh, for the next uh, day and, and plan on uh, us departing on Saturday. So with that, uh, appreciate everybody's support um, for us uh, throughout the fire event, and uh, thanks.